Hi, let's learn some Chinese. I'm Stephanie and welcome to my channel. It's actually raining today, so I thought, well, why not to learn some weather words in Chinese? Let's get started. Firstly, raining. How to say raining? Okay, so in Chinese we say 下雨. I'll explain a little bit. 雨, here it means rain or raining. What's the meaning of xia? It means go downwards. So you can think about this. When it's raining, obviously, it's going like this. So, raining. Xia yu. Xia yu. Xia is the fourth tone. And you can imagine when it's raining, the rain drops. So, there you go. Fourth tone. Xia yu. Xia yu. And if you speak it a little bit faster, it becomes xia yu. So, in order to say today is raining or it's raining outside, you can say 今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天下雨了。今天
So we say 刮大风, 刮大风, 刮大风. Very good. 那我们有时候会说, so sometimes we say 刮大风,下大雨. It's, it's very easy, right? If you say there was a shower or a drizzle, you can say 小雨. Now, for the drizzle part, we have another cute word for it, which is 毛毛雨. <laughs> it's my personal favorite. I find it's really, just really cute to say that. Uh, 跟我读, 毛毛雨, 毛毛雨, which means drizzle, those little drizzling. We call them 毛毛雨 or 小雨. So you can say 今天有小雨 or 今天小雨. All right, so how to say thunder? Thunder is 雷电, 跟我读, 雷电. But we don't really say that that often. Uh, what we say is 打雷了. <laughs> so if we see thunder, we would say 打雷, 打雷. You can imagine like the thunder hits the ground. So 打 means hit or beat. So 打雷, the thunder hits. Now I would like to introduce a sound or how we use Chinese to describe that sound. So the sound that thunder gave off we call it hong long long, <laughs> hong long long. So we would say hong long long de lei sheng, which means the sound of the thunder is hong long long. So besides the weather, there are two more adjectives that I would like to introduce to you. One is ru and the other is long. That's very easy to say. For example, wo hen ru, very hot. Wo hen long, I'm very cold. Now we do use these two adjectives to describe people's character. Uh, you can say this person ta hen long indicates that he is he or she is distant. Uh, often we would say long dan, long dan. But if you say long, if you just say this word in certain context, people get ya. Okay. So ru this word is slightly different. For example, in English, hot can also mean someone is very sexy. And in Chinese, if you just use the word alone, use this character alone, zhu, that doesn't make sense and can be a little bit weird. If you wanted to say sexy, you can add another word next to it, which is la, means spicy. Now, that will help you remember, actually. It's like hot and spicy means sexy in Chinese. So you can say ta hen ru la, and that often refers to girls. You can, I guess, refer to guys. Um, yeah, and la this, himself, la, this word itself, can also be used to describe sexy. I think this word alone can use to describe that meaning, but not the word ru. That's a little bit weird. Most of the times, ru in Chinese, it still means the temperature is very high and it's very hot in general. All right, so that's today's episode about some weather-related Chinese. I hope you enjoy it, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.